Good afternoon, it's Jilly Koo from the Sunshine Coast in Queensland, Australia. Coming to you with, I'm going to do a blow and kiss today. So it's kind of a Dutch pour come Aussie kiss, I suppose. So um, yeah, I'm calling it my kiss and blow or blow and kiss. So here we go. I add a bit of the, this is the Montmartre pouring paint that you don't, you can just pour straight from the bottle in different pours. So I'm just using two of the colours, which I'm using the lovely gold, which is absolutely gorgeous, gorgeous, sheeny, shiny gold. It's really lovely. And I'm using the bronze. What I've done with these two is I've mixed them just with a bit of Floetrol to see if I can get kind of some lacing happening on my canvas. So I'm just using those two colours out of the uh, pre-made. Then the rest is going to be my normal. So without further ado, like I said, it's going to be a kiss, or a, should I say a blow, and then a kiss um, with those paints. So let's get going. I might, yeah, I'm going to put some of my, oh, oh gosh white on the canvas pre pre coat it this is the Montmartre orange so I'm going to use some nice kind of citrusy colour this is the Montmartre yellow actually yes I'm forgetting I'm doing the kiss and blow so I want all the colour to be down here as well for my kissy kissy that's gonna go on um, orange and now I'm going to put some of the brilliant red in here Got some thinner white made up here that so I'm going to put it over this so I can use that for blowing but I'll just put a little bit of white in here too and I want to go this that real dark dark it almost looks brown but it's that real uh, magenta with a good blob of black I don't want to put too much to overpower it, but I do want something dark in there for when my kisses come. Kisses come. Available in there. Okay. Oh, shut your mouth up. You're dribbling. Okay, joke for the day. Joke for the day. What did the beach say to the sea when it came in? What did the beach say to the sea when it came in? Ha ha, long time, no see. Okay, thanks for whoever it was that gave me that one. Just a nana joke, I reckon. These are just nana jokes. Just silly, nonsense nana jokes. Just lighten the mood. Crazy but light. Okay, I'm going to just try this little thing a bit further out, away from my colours. I'm going to run the gold and that bronze so don't kind of get too caught up in the colors hopefully it will give a bit of a fringe to the other bright colors well that's the idea anyway but as we all know sometimes it doesn't go to plan just as life doesn't go to plan but you just try these things so so go with the flow only going to end up with a small amount of negative space if that by the look so I've got my um, too cool for school
Okay. Okie dokers. Okie dokers. Kiss. Done the blow. Gonna kiss. Just want to see what if I can blow out a few more of these. See the gold has left a little rim around that beautifully. Got to practice doing that a little bit better because bringing the gold and that out further is sort of creating a really nice um, outline. Goodness, that is pretty nice. I like it. Very nice. Very pleased with that. Different styles. So I'm going to get my happy smiley balloon. For happy smiley people, my smiley darling, smiley miley. So get my happy smiley balloon and get kissing here. Let's give this a go. The paint might need to sit a little while to absorb into the canvas, but we just. Oh my goodness! Should be putting those out on another canvas, shouldn't I? These lovely kisses. Just put them on that piece of card, see how we go. Oh, absolutely gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. It's pressing them out on the card, but you can see how lovely that would look on a canvas. I have to have a prepared canvas to do this on next time get too carried away in what I'm doing and oh I love it I love these two together I love the kiss and blow it's the go kiss and blow it's the go oh so nice so excited don't want to do too much around there because that's quite beautiful as it is but that is a Donna, I love it. Like I say, the only person you have to please is not the masses, it's yourself. So, oh my God, I'm so excited with that piece. That's it, isn't it? It doesn't need any more. It really doesn't need any more. I'm gonna turn this around to get the view that I'm getting because it is very pretty. Um, that way or that way Let's try that one Let's see what do you think what do you think let me know I love it I love the two different styles in one canvas that is beautiful love to do that on a bigger piece for my son and his partner um, okay so my idea putting that lovely silver and gold around the out further out I'm gonna work with that idea further because I can see that when you blow out your paint when you've got that lovely gold or silver further out in your canvas it ends up like lacing like um, adding a line of like this gold through there it looks as though it's just been and a gold through there it's absolutely gorgeous so I think a thicker amount of it uh, further back will cause some lovely effects like it'll cause the to um, outline your the blow I've just got my little teeny tiny balloon here which is just about to cark it because it's leaking so this will be the last time I use it just wanna just put it in there where I've seen a round circly bit that I didn't like just so a little teeny tiny water balloon often does some nice finishing touches to your work so I will love it I really do love that I hope you do too please let me know what you think and if you're gonna give it a go please put your work up on my acrylic art Australian acrylic pouring group by Jilly Q actually over the moon with that that is so vibrant 
And there's some of my kisses on the cardboard. Next time I'm going to have the canvas ready to do these balloon kisses or medallions or whatever anybody's calling them these days on. But my kiss and blow. Thank you so much for joining me. I'm so excited about that piece because it is a flipping stunner. Oh my goodness. I'll put photos on at the end so you'll see how it's dried. But I'm loving that and I hope you do too. So again, thank you for subscribing to my channel. It is greatly appreciated. It's absolutely free. So just check that you are subscribed. A lot of people have said they thought they were subscribed, but they weren't for whatever reason. I don't know. YouTube often does some weird things. But for now, I'm really happy with that. And I'm going to take this adventure with the gold and the bronze further out to see if I can get a better outline. So bye for now, guys. Thank you.